welcome back welcome to this week's vlog in this week's vlogs i'm gonna be taking you with me to work i'm gonna be taking you with me to the gym you're gonna be sharing the week with me sharing my life with me starting with today things are different i'm a new me that's not gonna happen that's not gonna happen that's not that's not gonna happen as you can see i'm in my get up for those of you who are new to my channel or this is the first vlog that you're watching I am a board certified family nurse practitioner in home care. I recently just started. So this is why I'm a little bit behind with my uploads. Guys, they're coming. My hair uploads, my fitness, up, they're coming. <laughs> I'm just trying to keep my head afloat with this part of my life right now. But today we're going to go see some patients. And then I'm kind of going to go into home care and what that is. When I was looking at like possible jobs, there really wasn't a lot of information on home care. So it's very interesting, especially if you're a new NP and you're thinking about going into home care as a career, some things you should know. So I'm going to show you my little handy dandy bag. And when you are working in home care, you have to bring this bag around. And this is basically like a hospital bag on wheels. You have your gloves, you have your garbage disposal kind of things. These are all your vital stuff like blood pressure, temperature, pulse ox. It's all in here. Of course, you have your hand sanitizer. You're going to need that and in your sharps container. So it's all in there along with the paperwork that you need your patient to sign. This is your lifeline, of course. You have to chart. So like in the hospitals, we have the cows, the computer on wheels, home care, you're gonna have your laptop as well as your Wi-Fi, <laughs> so that you can actually get, you know, internet and like log on to actually see what you need to for the patient, put in your orders. Home care is a really amazing field, especially as, you know, people are aging. <laughs> you get older, you can't always get to the doctors, so, we come to you so i think it's a good thing but if you're coming in as a new grad there are some things to know okay we're back <laughs> so i just wanted to give you some information especially if you're graduating from your master's program as a nurse practitioner you're more likely to be offered a position as a new graduate in home care or even nursing homes but honestly as far as home care understand that you are kind of like on your own like if you you have to have really strong assessment skills but you have to be comfortable with your own judgment you have to be good with your lab interpretation um you know there's really no you you work by yourself so if you're someone who really enjoys like being autonomous making your own schedule sort of <laughs> as well as um working independently i do enjoy that that's my personality like i kind of like doing it solo <laughs> then home care is for you but i'm not sure if it should be your first job like, there's a lot of self-learning that you have to do like you have to independently look up things that you don't know um it's a lot it's a lot for new for a new np Hi guys, hopefully you can't hear my kids upstairs. They're going crazy, but um, I just got home. It's like 3.30 in the afternoon. I have five patients today and job is not done. I still have to go in and chart on them, put any orders in, review their labs, make phone calls. So if I have to call family, um, this is the time that I will do it if there are any abnormal labs or anything like that. So getting ready to do that. Once I'm done with that, my day is finally over. So I'll probably be done, complete done working at about five o'clock. All right, guys, the day is finally over. It is after 10, a little bit after 10. I'm getting ready to tidy up the house and then go to bed. Tomorrow we are going to the gym. I've been neglecting that area of life and so tomorrow we're picking it back up. So I'll see you at the gym.
Okay guys, so we just came home from the gym. I know we're looking real rough. <laughs> I'm about to jump in the shower, but before that I wanted to make a little smoothie. So that's what we're getting ready to do. Two o'clock in the afternoon, I haven't put anything in my body, so I'm starving. After I have this smoothie and shower, I'm going to start making dinner. All right, so we've already added the smart fruit to our smoothie. So we have some strawberries that we're gonna add, raspberries and some mango. And then the rest, water, coconut water, and ice. It's good. All right, guys, I just got off of work. Now I am headed into Bed Bath & Beyond, pick up some decor like a bedspread set because honestly I'm tired of looking at the one I have All right. those who know me know I love gray I think this is the one that I'm gonna get hi guys so right now we are headed to the mall I'm getting ready to go to Sephora pick up some products skincare or makeup Another hair product. I'm gonna see if they have it as a brand. It looks good also, but fingers crossed that it's at Sephora. I just want to Guys, this is a must for dry, brittle hair. And you already know the Living Proof Repair and Restore Leave In is my favorite. Alright, guys, so this was the heat protectant, I, the new product I was looking into, but it's completely sold out, of course. So I might have to go online. Good morning, guys. We are up close and personal today. <laughs> it is Sunday. It is around 9.30 a.m. I'm getting ready to watch my spiritual program for today. Uh, I usually watch for I've watched Joyce Myers. I think that she is amazing. But every Sunday morning, if I'm not in church, I'm watching something. I'm putting the word into my, you know, life and daily practice. It's my little blurb <laughs> about spirituality being important for, you know, just a positive, productive life. We're going to end it there. If you guys have not already subscribed, what are you waiting for? Please subscribe. <laughs> and um, hair content is coming. It's coming. I'm just very intentional. I want to make sure I'm telling you guys things that are actually helpful. I'm not just going to put out a video just to put out a video. And because, you know, I'm my life is very all over the place right now. <laughs> Um, I just haven't had the time to think about tips that are going to be useful to you guys and, and practical in your everyday life. So, but it is coming. It is coming. <laughs> I'm so sorry that we're, we're a little late. So hopefully you guys will bear with me and I will see you next time for the next one. All right. Take care.